It literally can't hit me. This is insane. What's up guys, it's Moshman, I'm back on Atlas. I've got a new parrot, old oh boy, Pilky the parrot, looking cool. They actually increase your fortitude, that's their buff they give you, it's pretty cool. But I've had a little upgrade on the uh, Windrider, I've given her four small speed sails now. In the last episode I was trying to level up the ship by killing SATDs. We'd made this ship to be a speed ship, and it is super quick with the large speed sail and the small speed sail. And I wondered whether if you stuck as many small ones on there as you could, um, how quick it would accelerate. So uh, I've gone ahead and put four on here, that's the maximum I can get on here. I'm going to try and find some ships that are damned and see how quick we can pull away and just try, try and keep them at range with the cannons. I've got an extra cannon on here, add a little bit of a move round. They're all 112% uh, increased damage on them as well. So I've got a bit more firepower. But I just sailed out here from the island and it weren't as quick as I was anticipating, but it does take off quickly. And that's what I was hoping for, just the acceleration. So we're going to try that out. But if you're new to the channel, guys, uh, and you like the content, smash that subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell if you do subscribe so you get notified when I put up videos. I put up videos weekly and I'm hoping to do um, a few more live streams on YouTube as well so uh, yeah don't miss out on them so make sure you smash that bell. And more importantly if you enjoyed the video don't forget to smash that like button for me. But anyway I'm going to try and find some ships to damn. There's usually some right here but uh, Sodders Law when you want them they're not here. But I'm going to try and find some and we can test out how quick this accelerates. Well, wow, there's a ship of the damned, uh, and it's literally just got to night time. Hopefully, um, the gamma's all right, and you can see all right. But yeah, let's uh, open the sails up. So it accelerates quite quickly, like up to its speed, but it doesn't have a very high top speed. Uh, and I'm wondering, uh, depending on how this goes, uh, maybe swapping a medium speed sail onto the ship and seeing how many small sails we can get on afterwards. But let's see if this works. Cause the idea being, I want to keep being able to accelerate on demand. Right, there we go, we caught the wind. Oh, and we're leaving it behind. So as that locks on, it can't actually hit me. Let's let it catch me a bit. Open them sails up. Oh. oh my god, it's really good. Oh my god, that's nuts. I'm going to shut the sails, let it catch up, wait for it to fire at me. Here it comes, it's firing. And we're gone. That is so cool. It literally can't hit me. This is insane. Um, obviously the whole idea of me building this ship was to be a speed tuner to it hammer it around the map as quick as I can and uncover things. Uh, but I think while I'm levelling her up to increase the weight on it, um, I'm going to keep it like this. This thing cannot hit me. Oh, as I've said that, I've been hit. That's the first time it's hit me, and that was because I wasn't paying attention. But we destroyed that so quick. That is actually insane. So it's not as quick as it should be. Like That's not as quick as um, the large speed cell and small speed cell together. Look, the top speed's a lot, lot lower, but the acceleration is nuts. I think if I took one of them sails off, I don't think I'd be able to get out of range that quick. As you see the cannonballs leave the end of the barrel of the other ship, and you press W to move, to open your sails, it's already lost its target. It's so good. Uh, it was only a level 9 uh, ship of the damned, but I'm well happy with that. That's pretty cool. And we've got a level up. Uh, actually, how many levels did we get? Got two levels off that. 12k weight now on here, so that's pretty cool. I've got another one here, it's level 5, let's see if we can uh, do anything with this. Oh boy. Hope we can turn around quick enough without getting rammed. Oh no. Oh, what a disaster! Alright, here we go. I'm sailing into gunfire here. Let's go. Hopefully, he won't hit me again now. See, when I'm a bit closer, it's not as good as the first time round. I need to get a bit further out. Somewhere there, should be good. Yeah, he's fired at me, let's get these over. Oh man, it does work, doesn't it? Yeah, I think if you just took one sail off there, then. No, you'd have to take two off I think to get a medium sail on. I don't know if you could have a medium and two small, that'd be pretty cool. 
Yeah, well that didn't go as smooth as the first one. But once you're like too close to them, like you're too close and not to miss, you know? But once you move out to a nice range, they can't seem to lock onto you properly. I think while we're still next to my island, um, I'll take her back to the yard. Oh no, I've accidentally grabbed a sailor. Has that got it? Yeah. Now I think um, before I get too far away, I'll take the ship back to the dockyard. See if I can get a medium sail on here with two small sails and we'll try that out before I get too far away. I don't know whether I can do that or not, but we'll go have a look see if I can. Oh, I've got a level up as well. So the ship's level 40 now and we're at 12.1. And while we're talking about the weight actually, so to put the extra sails on here, I had to move my stairs, I'll show you in a minute. I've had to add a ceiling tile in, which has obviously added a little bit of weight. And then plus having four sails has added weight. It was 2.9 with the large speed sail and the small speed sail. With all these and the extra ceiling tile, is 3.1k. A little bit of trading weight, but I still think it's below the threshold to its maximum speed. So that's alright, but like I said, with these four small speed sails, you you know, the top end has gone complete, really. But the acceleration is phenomenal. Oh yeah, we're flying now. Got the medium sail and managed to keep two of the small sails. And it's much quicker. Uh, it takes off pretty quick as well, so hopefully it will do the same as the four small sails did. And uh, we'll stay out of range of them cannons. It don't really matter because they don't hit that hard, but I just wondered like how effective it would be. And like we see with the four, we was hardly getting hit. I can't see a thing, thanks to the fog. Uh, it's making it quite hard to see the massive lime green ships I'm looking for. Uh, I found one, what level is this? Oh, level one. Oh, man. Oh, well, we'll shoot it anyway. At least we can test it out. I've got the, um... oh, no, there's another one there. What's that? Oh, a level 25. So I've been and got the other sail. I managed to keep two small sails as well, so that's pretty cool. It does take off pretty rapid and it's got a much higher top speed than the four small sails. Hopefully we'll get the same result as the four speed sails. Maybe get hit once or twice. One on the right is a level one. Not really bothered about him, although I don't want them all at once. You know, let's try and pick him off. But here we go, we we'll get in the front of it. Right, he's shooting at me. Let's see if we can get away. Oh, do you know what? I think it is enough. Just with two small sails. And we've given ourselves a bit more top end speed with that medium sail. Oh my god, this is sick. Oh no. They would have hit me if they were on target. Oh, we got it. Well, there's one down. Hopefully, them other two are still here. Here we go, we're closing down this level 11 now. Hopefully, we won't tank too many shots on the way in. Oh no! I overcooked it! There's two hits. Oh, I've got no wind. As soon as you catch the wind, you're out of the way. Oh yeah. There we go. I'm just pulling forward and then shutting the sails. them too but I've just been waiting for them to fire and then pulling away. Looks like I miss them too, that's why they hit me. But then that was it. He did. What is that? Something keeps exploding on the boat but it's not them. Oh mate. One more and he's dead. I'm just stop start turning around I think. Should get him. Oh yeah. So he hit me twice, and that was because um, I overcooked it as I tried to engage him. But this is working so good, I'm well impressed. It's not as quick as the original ship we built. Um, and I, like I said, once I've levelled it up, I'll probably take these cannons off. And we'll just have this as a speed ship. But what I might do is replace the cannons with ballistas, I think, maybe. So I can use them to uh, whale hunt and also 
kill the Cyclopses. So that was a uh, level 11, that didn't level me up that one. Yeah, he did. Uh, but there's a level 25 here somewhere. Oh, there it is, there's another one spawned as well now. The red one should be a level 25, yeah. And a level 3. Alright, let's try and get this 25. Oh, no, I think we're going to end up engaging both of these. Oh, here's a 25, let's lock him on. Got him. Here he goes, he's launched his first shots and we've opened the sails. Oh yeah, no chance. Shoot again, let's open the sails back up. I should land him awake somewhere. Oh boy. Close now, so I've opened them a bit sooner. Hope that misses. Oh, he's so far off. Oh, he's still on quite a lot of health. Weren't expecting that. Oh no, that was a disaster. Oh, I've cocked this up now because I've got him zigzagging, so he can always broadside me. I can't hit him. Here we go. Should straighten him out now, Oh, there Oh, no! Oh, I've really cocked up. Weren't paying attention. I've lost some planks. I don't think I've got any... Oh, no. I don't think I've got any... No! <laughs> oh, I was so excited that I was destroying him. Oh, go on, kill him. Oh, I'm going to lose a load of my crew and, all, and a load of gold. No, <laughs> I didn't bring any spare planks to save weight and I haven't got a smithy. Oh boy, can we make it back to my base? <laughs> no way. Oh, it was nearly good if I was only paying attention. Oh, no. <laughs> no, you absolute numpty. Oh, I'll tell you what, that's going to be close. You might actually make it. I'm going to lose this ship, but I might make it back to uh, the base at least. Oh, look at that for a bathtub. I'm probably going to lose my ship still, but uh, at least I've got a massively long swim back. We're going down, boys. Oh, I love this ship as well. Oh, I should have been paying attention. Oh boy. Oh, the wind riders no more. Boy ship. Oh boy. Look at it. Well, it weren't a complete disaster. I managed to save all my blueprints I've collected. And my maps. And my gold. Oh boy. There's the remains of the wind rider. R.I.P. Absolutely gutted. I love that ship, it was so quick. I'm going to have to rebuild another one. I've got the ribs of a brig down there ready to go. So uh, I think I might build that first. Obviously we've got the storm cooler, but I'm going to build a multi-roll brigantine. Oh boy. going to use it for everything, but it's going to only have weighted sails on it. I want to see how much weight it can get on it. Add a bit of an extension on the base down there, looking cool. Kind of like it now. Looks a bit like an old coach house or something. I'm going to put the boat building and a tour of the house in another episode, I think. But I hope you enjoyed the episode, guys. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to smash that like button for me. It really helped me out. And if you do like the content, hit subscribe, ring that bell. Get notified, obviously, on any new videos I put up. Uh, do weekly videos, like I said earlier. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed it, guys, and I'll see you next time.